Hey YouTube, what's up guys? This is Charlie. Today I'm going to be replacing my Dexcom G6. So I had it on my abdomen um, in the last couple of days. I had it on there for like three days. I was coming out of my vehicle and it hit the side of the vehicle. So it actually started beeping and that's how I got to know that it was telling me that something is wrong and I need to change my receiver. So right now I have to replace it. I'm going to put it up on my arm. I was actually, actually was making another video of the installation where I was putting it in on my abdomen right there but um, I'm just gonna do it and show you guys how to do it um, up up here I'm gonna try it up here instead to see if it's safer up here so this so this is all the boxes here with all the equipment we have the receiver the transmitter and we have the little gadget to put it on here so the transmitter can go inside of it right there this is the receiver in the case in the first case that it was in the one that was that was stuck to the side there's a little lip on the side here you're just gonna hold this and bend this back and break it out and this part here you're just gonna pull it out so this normally just goes in so you just pull it out and that's it it comes out in two um here i have some alcohol wipes you want to get these these are pretty inexpensive and this is a walgreen brand so we're gonna make sure we have two of these some waterproof transparent dressing um i'm waiting for the for the one that is specially made to go around the receiver to come in they should be in today and this is from 3m 3m makes some really good ones so these are pretty good i've used them i had them on actually and they were on for a few days so i'm gonna put these on there you're gonna have to cut it the shape of the transmitter so so here we go with the, with the dexcom sensor machine right there so that's the one you're gonna use you just basically open it up remember that number here you want to you want to save that number there you want to save that number and um, it's going to be the same number on the all three open our wipes right there so we're just going to i'm going to clean a big area right around there i'm going to break this part here this part is really to protect right you don't you don't never really press this before you use it so we're going to just snap it out that's where you're going to put it so you're gonna take out your make sure you don't press that's the reason why that that um safety is there so there we go make sure you don't press your hands don't go anywhere close to the trigger and we're gonna get this right there just kind of you know like that and now you want to press the trigger and there we go there was a small little bite but that's Almost didn't feel anything. Yes, there we go. It's on. And take our transmitter. And we're gonna clean that. Clean the bottom of it because we've used it before. And just kind of air dry it. You don't wanna. So you can see the shape of this and the shape of this. So that tells you that it goes this way. So you push it in into the groove. And you heard that two snap and it's in. So you're gonna to have to add it in, in there. So it's asking if it's a new sensor, you're gonna click OK. It's gonna ask you to go through the process. If it's your first time, you're gonna to have to go through the for the process. Um, it's asking for a code. So we're gonna and I have my code. Right behind here, there's a scan or a code. So you put in your code, you click OK, and it's gonna take up to two hours before you receive any any kind of um, stuff on there. Um, on your smartphone, you can download the app. And um, for my phone, it was a problem. Um, I couldn't get the app to to work. It's not compatible with my Note with my Note. Um, 10 plus actually went to a hack app that a guy did it's called build your app you can google it or i will leave the link down, down for you below you download it you have to side load it onto your android device and that's the only way you're gonna get that to work for now and same thing here asking me is it a new sensor and i'm gonna click yep asking for the code enter code I can take a photo or put it manually and I can put it manually. It asked him did I put it on? Yes, I did. Next. This is going to take a few, it says warming up, um, five minutes remaining, but I think it's going to take two hours, like just like, just like this. Here. 
All right, guys, so I just came back. Everything is working. Um, we can log in right here. You can see there and here. So we can see we have both of them working. So you can, I can have both of these work. I can go to work with this one and leave this at home or either one at a time. They both basically give you the same graph and everything and keeping you in check. Um, right now I'm at 135 and everything is working perfect. So we're gonna take this. This is gonna go like here, so. Open up our bag. So we're gonna bend this in two, just like that. We're gonna cut a hole in there, just enough to go around this. So, make sure it can fit, and it's good. And now, take off the sticky pad. I'm gonna bend this. See how I bend it just like that. I'm gonna take it out completely and uh, there we go. Put this in. Losing around there, nice and snug. And then we can take this out. And just smooth down the edges, and there we have it. So now the main thing is to protect the edges around there so it doesn't lift up. So you want this to last as long as possible. Um, if you like some people on, if you like some people and you want them to make it last up to 30 days, 20, 20 days, 30 days, then you can go ahead. I might have to do that because I lost one, like I lost one last night, so I might have to do that, but that's it. Looking really good.